Thank you for joining us for this module on your Market Stats program launched September 2019. You have the ability to compare up to four areas on the same handout or social media link. This particular module is only on comparing four. If you need the basics or other portions of either InfoSparks or Fast Stats, you do want to just pop into the other modules. Once you've done that and you still have questions, please do give 382-8800 a call, and your dynamic tech support will help you with your specific questions. I am Beth Ann, your training specialist, and I am going to jump right into what is market stats from the icon on the front. And within market stat stats, there's InfoSparks as one application and there is Fast Stats. We're focusing on the customizable program, which is InfoSparks. When you come in, it is in the entire MLS. You have either established your own areas by now, or you simply want to perhaps compare zip codes or areas. So let's start out with the east side. And then specifically, with here's your median sales price, and we'll go to one year back. Then I also want to compare that specifically. Notice how I clicked on Add an Area. I go to the drop-down. I'm going to pick Zip Code this time and type in 85730. When I click on the gray box, I now have the specific details. And actually, the median price right in 85730 because there are more than one zip codes in that particular category. We have... Uh, about, what is that, 13.5 differential. Now, you also, they're specifically looking at perhaps Rita Ranch. I have set that up as an area within my own areas. So I'm going to go down and go up to Rita Ranch and click on that. So now we see the price differential between Rita Ranch and... 85730 and east side. Let's look at see how many homes are for sale. Now, these are of all categories. Here's where it really kind of becomes magic. Let's look at homes between 183 and 224, only single family residences, homes that have two or three bedrooms and homes that have two or three bathrooms. 35, 11, and 10. This can be very impactful if in rather than a line, you create a bar graph. You could even go three years back to see the trends. All of these are explained in the other modules for market stats and info sparks. Notice that you still have a fourth one. So perhaps you want to know how it compares because they may also be looking at, I'm going to go to my areas, I have one set up for Saddlebrook. And you can really look at the differential. For Now, we did click back into all kinds of properties, right? So in Rita Ranch, I'm just going to go back to all prices, all properties, all bedrooms, all bathrooms. If you want to compare that specific home you do have to make sure you pick it for east side, the zip code, Rita Ranch, and Saddlebrook. If not, it will include all price range, all properties, all bedrooms, all baths. I did not get incredibly specific with the square footage or the range of year built. Really great if you go ahead and hit print. What a customized handout this makes for you to see the large decline in inventory year after year. Uh, this one, even as mild as it is from last year, is still down 13, 6. And, of course, it's all branded for you. You could also create your social media link for this information. Static means it will be the same month every time they click on it. And, of course, live means that when our numbers are updated around the 6th of this month, but next time they click on it, say January 10th, it would, of course, update with uh, the latest, it will say 
January 2.20 because it would be December 2.19 all the way back. So let's close this. And let's say thank you very much for attending. If you have additional questions, please watch some of the other modules. And if not, give your tech support a call, 382-8800. Stellar spelling.